The Angry Llama is made for adults who enjoy honest, crass, cutting reviews when we're talking fucking llama. Sensitive bipeds need not apply. Hey, what's up, guys? My name's Spida. Hello, I'm Mr. Tux. Hi, I'm Dreams Ballet. Hello, I'm Dink Whitey, too. Hi, I'm Sinks. Hi, I'm Dread Jim from Los Angeles, California. Welcome to the Bronze Bandits, the weekly show that follows six Overwatch strangers on their 90-day journey from bronze crapitude to plat platitudes. This show each week is going to be an honest representation of what it takes to go from bronze to platinum in the game of Overwatch. I hope you join us along the way. They're going to need your support, tips, suggestions, and workshop codes. They're going to need all the help they can get to climb from hard stuck bronze to carrying in plat in just 12 short weeks. Throughout the show, we'll check in with each of the players and get their feedback on the matches. You'll also hear special coaching instructions and set up scrims that will help the Bronze Bandits learn their roles. Tonight, you're going to see a deep dive into turrets and trying to get through important chokes. We're going to sit with them, watch them go through their first match now and see what the problem it is. And then from there, we go right into a tutorial on how you and your team can defeat this kind of setup. Let's get right into it by introducing a few of the bandits we'll be following first tonight. Mr. Tux and Dink 182. Uh, not wasting my abilities as soon as they came off a cooldown. Uh, and actually, I felt like, uh, especially with my defense matrix as D.Va, I was able to use that pretty effectively to deny the enemy ult charge and also protect my team. I'm scared. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I'm so excited. This is the first Bronze Bandit, and I am on board with Mr. Tux, Sox Fox. <laughs> He's really a great guy. He does a ton of Discord work for me every day because I am old and don't understand what's going on. So he says, hey, Lama, just look that way. And then he makes it all happen. And then he's like, ha-ha, these things happen. And he's pretty invaluable. So I will pick on him incessantly anyways because I don't know how to be nice or patient. So here we go. What I'm looking for most, because guys, I have actually seen this match uh, when we filmed it live, but I saw it from all different perspectives, listening to their comms, really just kind of watching it from any angle I could. Every single one of them was streaming, which was great. Uh, but this, we're going to do a VOD review because I'm diving specifically in on Tux. Why Tux? Because he's running the D.Va and they're about to run up against a turret comp. We're talking cha ease. But it's good stuff. I mean, if I was on the other enemy, if I was on the enemy team, and I wasn't the DPS, I'd be like, "Well, I'm fantastic. I'm happy they have a sim and a torb. Oh, baby!" So we're gonna look at Tux. We know what they're gonna experience, but let's keep an eye out for his matrix. Uh, let's see if he's matrixing the right things. If he's focusing on the right things, I'm sure we'll find work. This is bronze. Um, we're gonna throughout the um, vod here. It's just gonna be to point A. We're going to focus on the team here, trying to get point A. So, what did we matrix there? We did some anticipatory right-clicking matrix. You guys know what I mean? Like, he, 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 went, into the, um, he went into the spawn there. <laughs> I mean, into the choke. And he put up his matrix knowing that they'd probably throw a ton of right-clicks. But let's actually see if that happened. Um, it's not a bad idea. Uh, except if you're about to push right then, you just burned half your matrix, right? So let's see what happens. Let's actually disconnect and we can see if things are going to hit his matrix. So he matrixes... Ooh, not much. Not much. The ant is going to sleep. We did not matrix that, but we got it with a dart. Okay, right now... You... Hmm... I don't like it. No, no. Okay, hold on. So, I don't like your aggression here, but again, this is your first push as a team. You guys were all kind of timid. No one wanted to talk. No one wanted to be the jerk. No one wanted to be, um, you know, just the one that's going to take charge. And we've had talks about this. We've already had our first communication talk, which I'll run you through in, in some time. Maybe not in this episode. Um, but Tux, I need to see you be just a bit more aggressive in your play. You've got a Matrix and you got Dreams right in front of you. Let's actually work with Ryan. When that shield goes down, Matrix, we can still push. Let's really try to enable him. Her, rather. Cool. Let's get back on with you. Um, what I saw, and let's get it back up to full speed, was that your Matrixes were a bit weird. So you guys are running into what? 
You're kind of doing side angles, but why? You keep matrixing this... No! All right, Tux, the thing that you're going to work on, because we need you on D.Va if we're going to run this comp, and I like the idea, D.Va, because, one, you're a bright guy, good problem solver, and you can kind of do stuff independently. So this is a good role for you, and this is going to be good. But here's what you need. You can't do Matrix against things where Matrix doesn't work. It is such a waste. So when you went into this doorway, Matrix. When you went into the Zarya Beam, Matrix. Like, don't. Don't do that. Um, you need to save that matrix for stuff you can do. And what are you doing over here? The team probably wants to get through the choke. What are you doing? Just saying hi? You're trying to defense matrix, the Zarya on a flank. Use your missiles. Just get rid of them quick. All right. Matrix, but fly. you can fly. Why are you guys backing up? What happened? Where's your team? What is going on? All right, hold on. So that put, oh uh, yeah, no, uh, okay. Job number one, Mr. Tux, is not teamwork. I know, it sounds crazy. Because you guys are in bronze and because teamwork is gonna take a few weeks to get down, that's not job one right now. Job one is living. And you went and you said, I'm sure I was yelling at some point about turrets. And you're like, I need to do turrets. But that's only after you say, I lived. And when I yell or anyone else yells like we talked about on the team, a retort in reply is not only um, expected, it is requested. So listen to that, guys, everyone out there in solo land. If someone yells at you and says, dude, where were my heels? That's okay. Answer them. I was getting died by Reaper. I was dead. I was nowhere near you. You were alone. You know what? I was out of the juices. Next time I'll say something. But that's a perfectly reasonable question. Fucking answer it. So, um, Tux, you should have lived here because there's a mega behind you. I can show um, the faithful audience here. It's right here. Oh, we hold shift. We go fast. Too fast. Oh, God. It's right here. So you zoom down here. You could have then, if you wanted to play peaky peaky and make space, why not back here? They really have nothing that can jack you. And oh, God, look at this. This is what you've been looking for. You've been looking for the straggler you can jack. So this is what you do, right? Your team's getting a little funked, right? And, and you're trying to get out of the way. I don't think you guys have died yet. Oh, you're the first death. So you caused this steamroll where you could have just went and gotten the mega. Oh, Tux, do you have a small hammer nearby? Great. Okay. Splay your testicles out on the table. That means to like lift them spread. Now you're just going to use a tap hammer and hit yourself in the balls until you learn to live, my man live so what i'm saying is you could have done a lot of work back here an aggressive diva in low ranks is oppressive but do you know how you get aggressive by being aggressive by knowing your 1v1s you got to know who you matrix who you don't matrix who you're waiting to flash he's gonna flash bank so i gotta matrix that oh i want to get the ananade what i haven't seen is an ananade problem or i would have been yelling at you because then your priority changes from uh turret duty mostly to the ananade duty but really what what you guys could have done is just used uh matrix to get soldier in here to just tick at the turrets you can drop uh, coal uh, not coal you can drop healing station, throw the shield up, just come in, take the turrets, and then peel left. And I think at the end of the night, we really decided that maybe that was the best route. But let's continue and see how we uh, go just a little bit more here on point A. And then we're going to just take a walk back and see what healing looked like. Let's see if the healers were carrying their weight in bronze. I don't know, is that fun? Like, is bronze lighter, and then silver's heavier, then gold's heaviest, then platinum's heavy, heavy, and then diamonds are like fucking rocks? I don't know. Where's my boy? There he is. Okay, Tux. Here we are. So, it looks like we're grouping up. This is great. Let's listen in on the comms for this section and see how it goes. They've been given a plan. You really wanted to escape there. 
Um, this Back. is just prolonging Mark. the inevitable. Sims on the right side. So now you're staggering yourself longer. Is real high. Okay, yeah, from this death on, I'm just gonna hear party comms and let's hear these guys go at it. Sorry, and then I will follow up Butter. and we will we'll then uh, look at the healing on this portion <clears> and see <throat> if it matches up with uh, what we're hearing. Torb turret on the right. Oh, I'm not. I don't have a shield for you. Anybody die? We got a Reaper. Oh. Need healing. Oh, sorry, Diva. Reaper pushing on cart. Oh no, wrong person in Nano, sorry. Um, Reaper oh. behind. Fuck me. Oh, I'm sorry, it was Tor by lead. Yeah, oh, tried no. to do it. Damn. Uh. Damn. Damn, they really went double turrets. They think they're good. I think they know they're not. That's why they went double turret. <laughs> not that it's a bad strategy, it's just you don't have to aim. about that how'd you feel heels were and stuff I felt like the heels were really good oh yeah I felt like I was getting a lot of support sweet I think these first couple might just be like a little bit awkward we have to find our groove um, you really should have matrixed him while he did that Anna could have slept him lots yeah. of things could have happened to him you should have been matrixing your McCree while he ultimated Not bad for your first team push, guys. You got the point. Let's dive in on the healing side and see what happened there. So what I think I did well today was keeping myself alive as well as communicating with the team, whether it be about alts or if I need any help or anything like that. A mistake that I made would be not managing my fade cooldown as well as it could have. There were definitely some... Um, situations where I needed it and I didn't have it and then I died and we might have won had I been alive. Um, as a team, I think the number one thing that we need to work on is just coming up with a strategy, a plan of attack, and going through with it. All right, now we're on with Dink182. Um, who has done about, I don't know, like 30 hours worth of work for the Bronze Bandits? Guys, I know it seems a little haphazard and put together, but it takes a lot of work to even do this. <laughs> but uh, next week's will be much easier. I just wanted to give a shout out to Dink uh, for all her help. Thank you. Now let's tear her a new one about her sh shitty gameplay. <laughs> hey, thanks for all your help for this, you know, volunteering and doing all this shit. Let me tell you how you suck. Get ready to cry. Yeah, it's not fair. I don't like you in front of everybody. Honestly, Dink, just don't start at the front of a door. Because in games, people are going to just send right clicks through, right? There's no reason to give them that. Just stand on the outside of the door, let the tank stand in front, count to two, and then move out. You still got a fade to catch up. You're good to go. I like the geometry wars that you pulled. You are um, seeing, but not being seen. Okay. I like that. A little too heavy on those heels. Oh, it looks like you want to support in there. Uh, your team doesn't seem to know where it's going, but you're doing a nice job following their momentum um they are taking a shit ton of damage though dreams ballet you gotta get in there brother or we need to get out but um whatever this is oh this hey dink what i want you saying is i'm low on resources and i want the tanks hearing that means unless we are full and they're low that we probably can't do an aggressive push think about this guys in any match, even if you're in solo queue, this is very good advice, okay? Let's say you go in for this mini push and all a bunch of healing resources get used on you. You see the healing orb go by, you get naded. When you back up and go in before 10 seconds is up, you're gonna die. All the things that were used to keep you up are no longer in their kit. They're gone. So this is what's happening here. I would be screaming out, 
Um, let's just back up a bit, back up a bit. Let's get some cooldowns, get some cooldowns. Let's get to plan, 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 plan. And we'd get everyone back up. We get them healed, and then we'd probably peel left or do whatever the plan is. But at least get some cooldowns, because right now you are ineffective. You have nothing you can shoot to gain damage, uh, to gain healing spap, uh, but a lot of responsibility in healing. Yeah, like you're not. Hmm. It's almost feeling like Moira's not the pick here, huh? I mean, Moira is a great... Moira's a great pick right now. Her orb is so overpowered, especially at these low levels. I'd rather see you one-trick this than maybe zen the turrets and stuff and learn all that. I don't know. I like that you're not popping your ult. Thank you. Okay, so right now, our problem is absolutely positively timidity and no plan. So the plan has to be coming from main tanks as they view things. I heard you guys yelling things out, which was great. It was like, we have a Bastion. We didn't, but at least we were calling stuff out. And someone should have corrected that eventually and said, oh, it's just a Torp. Okay, then Dread Jin and Sync say, all right, that's our number one goal. And Diva says, it would be my number one goal, but I got to handle these turrets, which are placed by the Symmetra. You understand what I mean? You got to divvy up some responsibility and hyper-focus turrets. Why? Because in bronze, turrets are the only thing that can hit within a country fucking mile. So turrets are like ultimates. If you see a turret, fucking shoot it in bronze. It's the craziest thing ever. Just kill turrets because it's so much better than the players. Seriously. Turrets. Kill turrets. But let's go. I want to hear... Um, Hold, sorry, I got a little sidetracked here. All right, so um, dreams, your timidity is a little high. I need you to get a little more pissy, a little more aggressive. You know what that means? It doesn't mean charge like an asshole. I didn't mind that fade. Yeah, but there's no heals to be done there. Okay, uh, Dink, so they didn't need that ultimate. Why did you feel they needed it? Because you heard the sig? If you did, that's okay. Um, if you heard the SIG and they lift it up, you want to bounce a healing orb at your feet to like a 45 to their little pylon they're getting busted into. So it basically goes through them as they're falling out, right? Um, but this coalescence, you really want to hit coalescence not on a perpendicular. You want to be hitting your teammates through them and killing the other team. If you can't do that with a coalesce, it's not a good coalesce, more or less. And you held it on your full health team for quite a while. Yeah, in that extra... Um, uh, you know, that could have... Honestly, if that coalescence was used a little better, I think we had the point there. Um, make sure you are using that damaging orb. And this is what we do in my team. Um, I say team, but it's just a bunch of old people at night that talk crap about our jobs and we yell about kids and about people walking on our lawn anyways it's not fun don't think you want to join okay but anyways every night when i play with my friends you know what we call it beam in the butt so anyone who's taken they hear beam in the butt it means move forward there's coalescence going right through you it's time to go that means the moira made the call it's time to go sometimes i'm that moira sometimes it's gamer tag sometimes it's even diablo tastic but they will yell beam in the butt and we go because what are they going to do to us? Like we got coalescence going right through us. It's fantastic. I'd like you guys to get into some sort of um, some sort of call out like that. Make sure that you be aggressive. Be -e aggressive. Okay. Let's watch a little bit more and then we'll get right into the tutorial where I brought the bronze bandits to Eichenwald and had them work through a comp that was similar from the farm. And they worked through this exact problem. So we'll see that in just a few moments. All right, bounce the orb. Okay, so what is the quickest way between point A and point B? If you said in the back, Lobo, a straight line, then you are right. But what do we want an orb to do, Dink? We want it to take the longest path possible to its final destination. Why? Because we want it to get used up, right? So instead of shooting, back this up just seats. Instead of shooting your orb at these folks, what I would have done, being amazing and four chambered in the stomach, is I would have shot my healing orb here, 
Uh, let's see. I, I want to give you accurate prediction. There's not a lot of particle physics. I would have bounced it here, and it would have went... You know what I mean? You want to do more angles so the thing takes longer. So as as you're shooting it this way, right? Oh, it's still sucking into them. Then it hits here. You know what I mean? So the longer you can make that geometry war orb take, the better it is for you. You do not ever want straight line orbs. You want bounces, baby. Bounces, bounces, bounces. Very rare that you want a straight line orb. Um, right now, hey, let's go see how the bandits dealt with it when I presented them with what we're calling the Washington, what are they called again? The, uh, they're the, <laughs> they're the, uh, hold on, hold on. Um, the Harlem Globetrotters, they always played a horrible team and they were the Washington, the Washington Generals, yes. So we are calling the farm team the Washington Generals. And what I do is I hop in Discord and I'm like, okay, this is what I want to do. Set up like this, set up like this, have a sim, have a torb, and I want you to flag a hog. And then I go over to the Bronze Bandits. I'm like, okay, so let's assume that they're going to have some turrets. This is what we're going to do, get it through the stroke. Let's watch that right now. Okay, so this what? is what we're doing. Oh. I am with the Bandits, right? Hello, Bandits. What I want to see is a Rhine Diva. Um, so, yeah, you'll be the Rhine. We'll have Tux on Diva. Um, I want you guys to play whatever DPS you would play on this, because that's not the important part. And supports, you do the same. Wait, my Moira's golden fingernails aren't on. Oh, no. Okay, everyone that's back up. Everybody gotta back up. Yeah, yeah, we got to restart <laughs> this. Oh, it's because custom games. Never mind. Okay. All right, yeah. so we have 10 seconds. Listen to my plan. You guys are not going to stop. We're going to use Matrix to get through the left to that mini. Reset, push point. Do you understand? Well, hang on, hang on. Say yeah. it again. Okay. Oh, you got to back it up. Woo! Okay. Then just fucking pause it for a second for me. Fantastic. Uh, okay. Nice. I guess pausing doesn't work, but whatever. Um, this is what I want you to do. I, I, I want shield up first. The moment shield is destroyed, we're throwing up matrix. Okay? Yeah. So shield up first matrix. Everybody is going to get behind. No one should be touched, and you should all make it to that left room. We're going to yeah. try this over and over again and see if we can't try to perfect it. The um, left, room. left room past the choke, you mean. Left the room past the choke. Okay. The one with the mini, yep. And let's try to be cognizant of any flankers. You don't know. They're silver and bronze. They could be anywhere. But what I want to do is really perfect this tank rollout and see if we can do it with the healers we have. Maybe to get through them with, the, with what they're using, we need to use a Lucio. Or something similar. But let's try this strategy and see how it goes. And then once we get past that room to the left, do we just do whatever we want? Or Yeah, yeah. this is all about the choke. We'll probably just see if you can get the point. And if you can, cool. If not, we'll probably just reset it. You know, we're not going to keep going for the point. We're going to reset it and try choke again. Okay. Cool. Okay. Excellent. Good luck, guys. Remember, this is supposed to be fun. So if you're not yelling and punching your genitals, it's not fun. Yeah, we ready? <laughs> yeah, so just to summarize, um, we're going to start with, we're going to group up, we're going to go behind Rhine Shield, move left, as soon as Rhine Shield is down, Diva, put your defense matrix up. Copy. Into the room to the got left. it. Get in front of me, big boy. They all Let's going? Go. All right. Shield at half, shield's going down in two. Okay, redo, redo your shield. Hang on. Okay, we ready to make the next push? No, my shield's still recharging. Okay, well, we gotta get out of here. Alright, let's get out. Left side, left side. Watch for turrets. Turrets behind. Eva, can you get them? Yep. I'm going... Oh, shield down. Oh, hog on the right, looking for hooks. Nice stun. Arissa, oh, sleeping on point? Yep. Oh my god, I'm beating. Oh my god, I'm beating. Soldier on the left. Soldier on the left. Uh, I tried to get the mercy. Can't heal you through shield. Oh, backing out. Sorry guys, I got hooked by hogs, but I hogs behind us. Hogs behind Can't us. Can't heal you through shield. All right, let's reset. All right. I mean the game. Yeah, yeah I don't know how to do yeah. that. Well, we at least made it to the room to the left. <laughs> 
That no 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 that that was the goal that was fan bloody tastic. I'm gonna go talk to the Washington Generals and I'm gonna up the difficulty. Okay. No. <laughs> I want to get the point. Uh, no, no, we're just practicing the uh, choke tonight. I'm sorry. We're okay, just practicing fine. chokes. Nama okay. is the boss. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Okay. They put me in charge. It's oh. true. <laughs>
Okay. I'm so sorry. I hit the wall. Okay, that reset. What happened? Did you get hooked back there? Yeah, we got we got hooked right as we came, or right as we got into the choke. Hog hooked our soldier. I added that problem. So yeah. now you have a boosted road hog trying to kill you guys as you push through. Very common. So that is now a problem. How are you going to solve that? Okay, I'm switching to Lucy. I'm going to try and do speed boost. This is kind of chintzy because we know it's there now, but if, so, I mean, so, the, so, the easiest okay. way to shut down so, a boosted hog is with the anti nade. Does that so mean we're just going to run past him? We're not going to try to kill him first? Is that what you're saying? That's a great question. So team leaders, we're just going past him. Did you hear? I couldn't hear you. Sorry. Yes. I would say D.Va stick closer to the support because it's easier if you get hooked rather than our supports. Yeah, I agree. Hello. Okay, Even though so I won't the have the answer is run past. Five, okay. Yeah. Four. Yeah. And then into the room left and then let's go straight into that other room that has the mini. You know what I'm talking about? On the left. Yeah, you'll see it out, out that left door. Ready? Okay, we're all yeah, one, two, oh, you know, you know, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, abort, abort, abort. In the side Teleporter room. bind? Teleporter bind? Yeah, that was it. Sorry, you uh, stepped out a little bit too much and you got like instantly critical. Okay, so what happened there? That time the hog was, uh, reset the game. That time the hog was much more aggressive. So Dread Chin's question comes back up. Are we just running past the hog? No, I didn't even see the hog. Him. Not no, anymore, maybe. right? He came. No. So, so this is what happened. He came behind your supports in the mega room and jacked people. Yeah, I didn't even. That was my bad. I didn't even see him. Did anyone else see him? Yep. Yeah, I called it out. Yep, there were calls. Okay, so oh, this okay. time, this time, I think we have to deal with him as a yep. team. How are we dealing with? We can boop him away on the hook. We can. Um, we can matrix whoever gets hooked, maybe even let someone get hooked, matrix it, and then dive him in anti. That might be a nice plan. Yeah. If he's going to be there, let's jabate him. Still go main. Like, don't go straight. I would forward. say do whatever Try you to can to not get speed. choke spam while killing Hog. So feel it out, sir, and call it as we get closer. So pretend to push up I'm and gonna then when go comes main. out we're gonna pull back there's a sim tp exactly. can you get it mccree someone's through the sim tp if you can get it down do you see it do you know what i'm talking about yeah i see it i keep getting boop my shield's down all right oh sorry oh, my I really anybody see hog okay. yep um yeah i got eyes on him back here right. i'm having i'm you lagging flank. we're flanking with soldier we're gonna go flank Ooh. their flank yeah okay. Ag. Soldier, we're not quite with you yet. All right, we might have to turn off some of these streams to kill the lag, especially at Spider's house, right? Uh, I'm better now. <laughs> yeah. All right, he's in the room to the right now. Good? It's okay now. Guys? Yeah? Okay. Move this I'm, the room. I'm lagging really the bad. The to the right where I'm shooting? Yeah, we're, we're going up the stairs, though. Go up the stairs. We're in main choke here. Oh, oh we're down. Oh. I got picked, sorry. That's okay, let's wait for He's her. He's down in this lower we, room. Yeah, 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 all right. Peel, but peel. you're alone. Peel back, peel back. All right, so someone yeah. should have been yelling at him. Tux was in there. He was engaging. Yeah, it was assertive, well, but he was out of position. I got hooked. Yeah. Well, there you go. Well, well, then he had no hook, and then I thought we could go in, but I should have oh, said well, that. Oh, well, fair enough. I, I didn't have the faith that you had. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, let's reset. Not the game, I'm gonna go over I, I to mean, the Washington the Generals and I'm gonna uh, have Hog switch it up a bit. Okay. Okay. I guess we'll just go back. Yeah. I think once Hog doesn't have hook, he's less of a problem. It's easier to kill. It's like slightly less, not that much less. That's true. If we okay. can get him to come out where we can see him, then it makes it a little bit easier for us to uh, kill him and possibly that Mercy, which would be a great pick for getting through. Because I think as soon as we the see the hog, we can flash McCree, call him out, and flashbang yep. him. And then we can... Let's most of us focus on him, but maybe like don't leave our backs to the rest of their team. Make, like, yeah, you know? we need to be fighting him out of the choke point. 
it needs to happen somewhere where the rest of his team can't help him. Ready when you get. Oh, we don't have our main tank. Oh, oh I'm yeah, sorry. no. I was confused doing game stuff, like figuring out whether I should restart the lobby. Okay, all right. We're gonna go okay, main. Right. So everyone, follow Sarah. Main. Look for a TP if they have one. They have a sim, so they have a TP. All right. We're all here. Yeah. I think we should cross choke. Is that a terrible idea? I don't know. Just let's try and go and right, go, go left go right, right away. Go far right. Go far right. Far right. Reloading. Everyone go far right. My shield's down. Hey, hogs in the room to the left. Right, I defense can see him. out. In the small oh. room. Are we all Everybody here? In. Hang on, right. Oh, yeah. That's my bad. I shouldn't have done that. Hogs looking left hogs side left still. Side, yeah. Just peel back and get your tank, and let's do it again. Back up. That TP is. Um, oh, that's. Oh, oh Anna. It's top. Out. Yeah, it's top on top of that bridge. Peel back, and Sarah, just make sure everyone has their right clicks, and then you say three, two, one, go. Right. Hang on, I was confused that we went into that room to the right. When when was that? I. She I, made I, it I on made the it. fly change, and um, just it didn't yell it loud enough. Okay, is that what you want to do then? Are we gonna now try going from room to the right? No, the hog's not there anymore. I thought we could pick the hog if he's over there, but he's not so, Brandy, there anymore. I think you're fixated on the left room thing from earlier. The whole thing is we're trying to get to point and how can we get around the hog, right? So oh, I thought we had to go to the room to the left. No, but oh, I think God. you guys should, hold on. I think you guys should. Now that the hog problem has moved, we've identified that problem. Well, fuck, it's moved. So what problem are we back to now? The choke problem, which we excel at. So let's go and do our choke solution. Initial plan. This in the room, in this little house? In this little house. I like that because it's a shorter distance and there's no one in that right room, so we're clear. Okay. Killer ready? Don't pop out yet, don't pop out yet. Ready. Sims up top, someone to the right. Shield at half, shield's going down, I was halted. Turrets are the first problem here. Is everybody here? Uh, I'm out of mechs, but yes, we're here. Oh my good lord. You guys played exceptionally well. Um, we played into ultimates. You did. You lived through something that no one should have. Um, if you guys watched this replay, it was awesome. Back into the mix. Was that molten core? I'm so mad at it. <laughs> Spawn nano. Woo! Oh, a spider? <laughs> Our bat needs healing. He's half. I do need him. So let's do the choke solution again and see how it goes. Okay, now, hang what, on. what happened last time? I think Diva got hooked back, correct? She did get hooked. Yeah. So if if they already had Splooge, they're going to have other alts. Hog is probably <laughs> definitely going to have alt because he was fucking around with us. Probably yeah, Mercy. So just keep keep a thought for alts. If you start, then there's new alts. No, no, well, it's we fine. Four, seven seven seconds. No, no, go, 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 go. Same plan. Come on, Ryan. Come on, Anna. It's good experience. Okay, everybody's I'll try here. Try and get the turrets when we go through. One, okay, two, three, go. Hogs on the right. Chill that low. Twenty-five. My shield's dead. Turrets down. Nice. Eva's D mech. Let's go. Let's go. rotate out of the oh. room. Get out of the room. All right, towards to the... point. Towards oh, point. I'm down. I'm down. Keep hey, Tarx. I see. I think I see a problem with your matrix. So yeah. when I'm seeing your matrix come through. It's literally, it needs to be up Ryan's ass. Ryan is counting on that. You're putting the matrix sometimes to the right, sometimes, no, 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 no. You don't matrix at all until Dreams Ballet calls for it, and then you just hold matrix and you eat everything. That way, everybody gets through. Everybody should be inside Diva, inside Reinhardt's ass. Move, move, move. Yep. Okay. Um, also, when we come to those problems, like particularly when coming through the first choke and we're just getting like shit on by turrets, like is that typically the off tank that should be going for those? Should I, as Anna, be ever looking to shoot those? Like, what's the think about uh, this about though? If, if if we're in a ball, those turrets shouldn't touch our healers. So if if those turrets are switching to you, that means we're kind of not tight enough. I want every. Okay. I, I don't want even fight those turrets. I want to get in the left room and not deal with the turrets. Okay. I have a thought. Okay. Can I share it? How dare you! I know. So, what if I try going Lucio for speed boost, and then Spider, you switch to BAP, because, and so, what, like, I find that we s slow down and try to shoot those turrets, but as soon as you get into that room with the mini, 
there's no turrets in there. But I think our issue is some people don't, like, you kind of get distracted. So then you stand out in the turrets a couple more seconds than necessary, which takes a lot of your health. But if I can speed boost this right into that room, and then maybe, Spider, you can put down um, uh, a mortality field to get us from room to the left towards the point, maybe that would be useful. Where are you suggesting the lamp goes? Like, in the room? Uh, out, like, when we're going from left room towards point. But so it needs to go in that room, though. Make sure that that thing's hidden in the room so you guys aren't getting, um, so it doesn't get melted. You know, it's got to go mm -hmm. in that, like, right in that initial stairway, doorway, right where the mini is, but on the, the other is. angle. Okay, yeah, we could try that. Now, okay. um, your Lucio plan's good, great. Um, Tux, Sweet. make sure you're doing your matrix right up Ryan's ass. Everybody else, yeah. tight as fuck. Yeah, because as soon as we get that. in that room, there's no turrets in that room so far. Let's okay. hear questions. So don't, don't worry about the turrets then, because that's part exactly. of why I Exactly. Don't worry about the turrets. Well. Now, okay. now, hold on, hold on, hold, hold on, though. Let me ask the class. In, on Hollywood, can we avoid the turrets? If we went left, we could Exactly. Have. Yeah. But if you go straight you gotta, or, or you take a right, you got to deal with them. So those are our choices. Yeah. If we went right here, we have to deal with them. If we peel left, we just avoid them. When there's a widow carry, a widow smurf sim problem, the best thing we can do is just rotate around them. And since we have teamwork, we can do that. Okay. So let's give it a go and try to just ignore the turrets. Okay. Dink, can you call out your speed boost? Yeah. Instead so of me calling push? Okay, I can do that. Yeah. Yeah. I like That's that a as good well. That's idea too. Unpause. I like the uh, unpause uh, countdown. Three, two, one. Attackers incoming. And you gotta make sure you're in my little Lucio circle. Okay, stop, Ryan. Oh, what? Okay, literally. Play, play the right side. Play the right side. Back out. Back out. Play the right back side. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. They already backed out. Okay. It's fine. They were just were they just drilling us? Okay, they're gone now. So tank, make the call. We're going main. Yep. Okay. Uh, What's happening? Why aren't we pushing? I don't, I don't Why know. Why aren't we talking? I'm, my all brain right. stopped working. Okay. We're okay, ready? all ready. Yeah. Ready? Three, two, one, speed boost. Uh, yeah, we got, we got, we got, oh, we got, nope. honored. we got. Holy rip. I'm stop. I'm dead, but I'm Oh, it was an anti that ruined us? Yeah, an anti. And, and there was a hey, bunch of point pause. To... Oh. Uh, just reset it. But, so guys, what happened there is we had like five to ten seconds of no leadership. And I yeah. think, like uh, like Dream said, like, oh, my brain just fried. Someone else has to pick it up. Remember, Dink, you were the shot caller on this one. You had to call oh, when was, to go. That was my brain. Like, as soon as they were there, I was like, oh, wait, <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, no problem. Plan. Give it a go. And I didn't realize they were going to troll us either. Please hold. I get yelled at. <sighs> okay. Okay, let's, uh, let's, we don't have to restart the whole, the whole thing. We can... Okay, so let's all heal up. We'll do our get in our little room here. No, make sure you have all your cooldowns up. Okay, uh, Ryan, Guys, did, did you, you get up there? Real quick, real quick. Listen, did you, see there right. a, did you see there was a turret up here where I'm shooting? No, I didn't. There was. Where? I saw the turret. Okay, where I'm shooting. All right, are we gonna try again? No one's gonna call out that hog across the room, Tux? Oh, I that is the hog. Okay. Yeah, yeah. call it out, brother. All right. Oh my lord. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. It's okay. Let's let's get Dink back. Uh, I'm gonna taxi the, the Lucia. <laughs> Thank you, soldier. You make me go. All right, right. everybody, <laughs> save their right clicks. We're gonna have to go. Stop playing peeky peeky. It doesn't do okay. shit. Okay. Okay, we're all close together. Ryan in the front, Diva. Yep, Matrix full. Okay, we're all ready. Okay, three. No, there's two. TV right in front of us. TV right in front of us. Can we murder it? Okay, yep. one. one. Three, two, one, go. Down one. Go, 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 go. Hold behind, hold behind. Oh, fuck, I went too I fast. I'm flipped. I'm flipped. Let's go, let's go. Oh, are you kidding me with this? Stay left, stay left, stay left. Okay, get out of the splooge. Get out of the splooge. To the left, to the left, to the left, to the left. Let's go. Okay, it's just me and Diva. Come on, Diva. We got this. Okay, no, we don't. Dream, to support. Dreams ballet. Yeah. When when we are going in against six, we don't fire strike. We keep our shield up and we do that part of our job. You can't okay, drop okay. it in fire strike. You're getting fucking owned. 
60 yes. seconds remaining. That's what you get when you have the nicest stream. I just watch yours. Oh. Uh, okay. You're gonna I... want to get a worse internet connection. I'm gonna be up. Yes! Guys, this is the last one. Let's reset it and try again, please. And okay, then I'm not gonna do Lucio. One. I'm off Lucio. Okay, so we're not gonna do a three, two, one. That means Dreams Ballet is back in charge of the call. Correct. What was that window? We could yes. use that window. What did I you don't, do? What, we wouldn't have a uh, window on first push. Those have just wasted them. <laughs> I want to try and do you, that for real. Are you saying bad? Yeah, but we wouldn't die in lava in first push either. Yeah. True. Enemy team right, dead. Right. Team weak. Ready? Three, yep. two, one. Oh, your main tank got hooked Breath. from the back. Lamps up. Okay, okay, lamps up. Uh, orb your you way, orb your way. Go through. Come on, um, run, you got it. Okay, let's get okay, out of this We're gonna move without running. Go to point, go to point, go to point. But... Just go to TP, point. Gotta lead. I'm getting hooked. I'm out of suit. And I got gooped on. Fucking goop. You know, they're not playing like they have no ults. Yeah, they are well, definitely. We're... we're gonna have to call an end to the ultimates. That's not really helping like, practice. Like, what is, it? is this? I'll yell at them sufficiently for the so next time, dumb. and we will make it a more enjoyable experience. But I like the format. What do you guys think? Zero. Yeah, no, yeah. I think it's just really good for practice. Right? Super helpful. And I think mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna then explain the method to you guys, and then see how you apply it to other problems. Dreams. The last thing that I saw, and I'm picking on you just because I'm only watching your stream. I'm sure everyone is making mistakes. What I would have liked to see you do right at the end here. You had shatter. And you were blocking Roadhog from hooking. I like that. But you weren't backing, you you weren't peeling back to your team at the same time. You were kind of just dancing with him a bit under that choke. And really, you needed to peel back while holding your shield up, kind of like a bank robber. I'm getting out yeah. of here. Cool. So you saw that too? Yeah. Okay, excellent. Guys, um, so that's it for the scrim. Um, I, I mean, that's it for this part of it, this portion. I'm going to hop off. Um, and you guys have a whole nother hour and 10, I believe, left to your practice. So hopefully you guys... What did you do well? Uh, I believe that I did a good job of staying alive and surviving. Uh, what hero did I feel the best on? Soldier always feels good to me, but I didn't feel like I got a lot of value out of him. Uh, surprisingly, Torb felt the best. Biggest mistake... Uh, Probably my positioning. Um, I lost track of where my team was very frequently. Number one thing the team can work on. Uh, probably just cohesion. Um, that will come with time, probably. Just uh, working together, having a plan. Uh, top two things to practice this week. Oh, top two things to practice. Um, number one for me is always going to be maintaining composure not getting tilted, that's an issue for me. Um, and also, uh, I mean, just better angles, better position, better aim. Uh, this week's MVP, I'm gonna split that between two people, Mr. Tux and Dink, 182. They both went above and beyond to make all this happen, so I'm very thankful. Thank you. Do you want to climb with the llama? Then you got to join the farm! Only 30% of the llama's viewers are subscribed. What horror! How can you expect to climb without the llama's daily father of views? Okay, hit your hooves on that sub button. We'll continue like none of this ever happened.
I like your strategy, Dreams Ballet. It's to run away <laughs> chunkily and slowly. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>